Raider Nation, how are we doing? Uh, Big Tuna here. It's been a while. I apologize. Um, been having some health issues as of late. Uh, I'm going to start getting back onto the workout plan um, in the next couple days. And I'll be able to explain everything to you guys then. But before we get into all of that stuff, first of all, let me say, first and foremost, thank you guys for watching. While you're watching, do me a favor, remember the like button, remember the subscribe button, comment below on your thoughts of this transaction. Also be on the lookout for Yankee Chatter, Raiders Breaking News, NFL Breaking News, whatever we can put out there, we will. Um, like I said, the Big Tune has been absent for a little bit. Um, he's going to get back up on that horse and start losing weight again. I have lost weight, but we've, we've had some health issues, and I'm going to talk about it, but not today. I'm probably going to put out a video tomorrow. It's going to be pretty lengthy, so... If you want to watch, if you got about half an hour or so to watch a video tomorrow, it's going to be a good one to watch. So, um, yeah, so, listen, the Raiders released David Irving, and I just think it was more or less of he was just kind of the odd man out. Maybe he wasn't showing much to the team, but they haven't done much for them to already want to release him because of performance. I think it's just that they brought in so many on the from from D ends to D tackles to defensive linemen as they would put on their roster. I mean, l listen to the names here. So this is just a start, okay? So you got Max Crosby, Cleveland Furl, uh, Gary Green, who's a one year guy, Malcolm Kuntz, who's the rookie, uh, Carl Nassib, Yannick Ngakwe, and Kendall Vickers, all guys that are listed listed just as defensive ends. Um, when you look at defensive linemen, just DLs, you've got uh, Darius Fillon and you've got Matt Dickerson, both journeymen. Um, and then when you go to D-tackle, you've got Jonathan Hankins, who we all know, Quentin Jefferson, who's been uh, in the league for a long time, Niall Scott, who um, is a three-year guy, Darius Stills, who's a rookie, uh, Solomon Thomas, who is the former number three overall pick, so... There just wasn't room for them, guys. And it's that's that's part of the NFL that sucks, is that they bring in so many... Oh, jeez, sorry, 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 sorry. They bring in so many during the offseason that some guys are just going to get released because of numbers. And maybe because of price? I, I'm not 100% sure. I just saw that he was released. I wanted to get a video out as soon as I can before I headed out for the night. Um, you know, overall, I'm not that upset about it because... In the little bit that he showed us last year, it was okay. It wasn't great. Um, I think that they brought in enough guys to take over for him. I mean, Solomon Thomas, Quentin Jefferson, they could take over for him there. Jonathan Hankins, who was already there. Uh, Yannick Ngakwe, but I don't know if they were going to play him at defensive end. And then you've got linebackers that can rush the passer as well. So, overall, I just think they're trying to say to Mr. Irving, like, hey, you know what, unless it's drug-related or he got in trouble again, but that hasn't come out. Um, but overall, I think they're trying to say to him, like, listen, David, we got enough players as it is. Why don't you go out there and try to get a starting job someplace else? Because I just think this team already has its starting lineup. Um, don't know who it's going to be yet, but I think they've got it already without Irving being in the mix. So we'll see what happens. But overall, not too upset with the move. You know, you're going to see this every once in a while, a guy that gets signed during the offseason before free agency, and then all of a sudden he's cut. It's just this is what they do in the NFL. It's just it's a it's a moving players game and it sucks. And personnel is never guaranteed unless you're a superstar, but it's not even guaranteed there. Ask Tom Brady. Um, so ask DeAndre Hopkins. Uh, so that's it, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching. Do us a favor. Like I said, like the channel, subscribe to the no like the video, subscribe to the channel. Um, comment below on your thoughts of this transaction, uh, and then, uh, like I said, anything Yankee chatter, uh, Raiders late breaking, NFL late breaking, you know, we'll be here, we got some new stuff coming out in the summer, and like I said, Big Tuna's weight journey will be back in the next couple days. We'll see you guys soon, have a good rest of your day, stay safe, and as always, let's go Raiders.